Hello, everybody. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God bless us. Welcome to day four of MFM's Pray Your Way into 2023 program. I pray that we are well, highly favored, and blessed in Jesus' name. Let's thank the Lord for giving us the strength to continue in this fasting and praying program. We thank the Lord for the redeeming power in the blood of Jesus. And Lord, we thank you for the power in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord God, for your love, for your care, for your mercy. As this year draws to a close, Anything that gave the enemy joy over our lives in 2022, let that joy turn to sorrow. Let that joy turn to sorrow. Let that joy turn to sorrow in Jesus' name. Powers that held on to us in 2022 and do not want to let us go. You're a liar. Release us. Die. Release us. Die. Release us and die in Jesus' name. Covenants of stagnation, break, break, break by fire in the name of Jesus. Covenants of stagnancy, break, break, break in the name of Jesus. Demons of stagnancy, die, die, die by fire in Jesus' name. Amen. We move forward by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Our topic today is, Oh God, arise and fight my battles. Amen. In the book of Exodus, Chapter 14, verse 14, it is written, The Lord shall fight for you, and ye shall hold your peace. Amen. And then in the book of Psalms, Psalm 35, verse 1, it is written, Plead my cause, O Lord, with those who strive with me. Fight against those who fight against me. Take hold of shield and buckler and stand up for my help. Also, draw out the spear and stop those who pursue me. Say to my soul, I am your salvation. Amen. God of Elijah will fight our battles for us in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's praise the name of the Lord God who fights our battles. Let's praise the name of the Lord God who gave the children of Israel victory over the Egyptians. That God is still alive today. He shall fight for us and we shall hold our peace. Let's praise him. Let's praise him. Let's praise Jehovah, our great deliverer, our great physician, our great redeemer. Let's praise him. Let's worship him. He's worthy to be praised. He's worthy to be adored. He is the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Give him all the glory because he is the King of glory. Bless his holy name. Bless his house name bless him praise him for he is a faithful God he is the same yesterday today and forever he is the ancient of days the rock of ages the bright and morning star Lord thank you for being a consistent God thank you for being a faithful God God we love you we adore you we glorify you and we magnify you in Jesus name in Jesus name we've praised him and we've thanked him let us repent and confess our sins. In the book of Isaiah, chapter 59, verse 2, it is written, But your iniquities have separated between you and your God, and your sins have caused him to hide his face from you that he will not hear. Amen. We do not want the Lord to hide his face from us. We want the Lord to regard us. We do want the Lord to hear us. So let's ask the Lord to forgive us of any sin, any iniquity that's causing us to be separated from him. Lord, show us your mercy. Show us your compassion. We know, O oh Lord God, that you are a merciful God. Lord, forgive us of the sin, the iniquity in our lives, in our families, in our bloodline. Sins that we know of and sins that we know not of. Sins that we can Commit in thought, word, and deed. Lord, forgive us of these sins, of these iniquities, and remove them as far away from us as the east is from the west. Let the blood of Jesus wash the stain of sin, the stain of iniquity, away from our lives. In Jesus' name, we've asked for forgiveness, and we are forgiven by the mercy and by the compassion of God. We also forgive those who've sinned against us, anyone against whom we're holding offense, anyone against whom we're holding a grudge. We go ahead and we forgive them and we release them from our spirit in Jesus' name. Amen. 
Let us cover ourselves and our families with the blood of Jesus. I soak my body, my soul, and my spirit, and that of my family members in the blood of Jesus. We soak our homes, our places of work, our places of worship, and our modes of transportation with the blood of Jesus. Every place where our feet trod, we saturate it in the blood of Jesus. Covenant blood of Jesus, cover us. Passover blood of Jesus, cover us, we pray. In Jesus' name, we are covered with the blood of Jesus. Amen. Now, for those who are praying with us and do not know the Lord Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior, if you want the Lord to fight your battles, you do need to make Jesus your friend. So you want to give your life to Jesus or you want to rededicate your life to him, repeat after me, please. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I am a sinner and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe that you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I repent from my sins and I invite you into my heart, into my life. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Congratulations. Your name is now written in the Lamb's Book of Life. We pray that the Holy Spirit overshadows you and remains your constant guide in Jesus' name. Let us also pray for the unsaved ones in our families and in our communities who have yet to accept Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior. Lord, open their eyes, open their hearts so that they know that the truth is in Jesus Christ and Jesus Christ is the only way to eternal life, to eternal salvation. Amen, amen. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Let's worship the Lord in song. Let's praise Him. Let's celebrate Him. Let's adore Him. Let's glorify Him in Jesus' name. Amen. Celebrate Him, celebrate Him. Just celebrate Him. If God has been faithful to you, if God has been awesome to you, just celebrate Him. Just praise Him. Just praise Him. Just press him. Just press him. Oh, be lifted above all the gods. We lay our crowns and worship. Sing it louder. Worship him. Oh, be lifted. Submit now. 
Let us submit now. Let us submit now. Sing it louder. We Just worship it. you always. Amen. Our scripture reading is taken from the book of Psalms, chapter 136. Psalm 136. Read along with us, please. May the Lord bless the reading and hearing of his word. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Psalm 136. O oh, give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endureth forever. O oh, give thanks unto the God of gods, for his mercy endureth forever. O oh, give thanks to the Lord of lords, for his mercy endureth forever. To him who alone doeth great wonders, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that by wisdom made the heavens, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that stretched out the earth above the waters, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that made great lights, for his mercy endureth forever. The sun to rule by day, for his mercy endureth forever. The moon and stars to rule by night, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that smote Egypt in their firstborn, for his mercy endureth forever. And brought out Israel from among them, for his mercy endureth forever. With a strong hand and with a stretched out arm, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which divided the Red Sea into parts, for his mercy endureth forever. And made Israel to pass through the midst of it, for his mercy endureth forever. But overthrew Pharaoh and his host in the Red Sea, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which led his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which smote great kings, for his mercy endureth forever. And slew famous kings, for his mercy endureth forever. Sihon, king of the Amorites, for his mercy endureth forever. And Og, the king of Bashan, for his mercy endureth forever. And gave their land for an heritage, for his mercy endureth forever. Even an heritage unto Israel his servant, for his mercy endureth forever. Who remembered us in our low estate, for his mercy endureth endureth forever, and hath redeemed us from our enemies, for his mercy endureth forever, who giveth food to all flesh, for his mercy endureth forever. O oh, give thanks unto the God of heaven, for his mercy endureth forever. Amen. One of the greatest prayers we can ever pray 
is a prayer of thanksgiving to God for all that he does for us. Thanksgiving and praise to God will never depart from our mouths in Jesus' name. Amen. Next is our scripture confession and for today's take from the book of Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 4. Deuteronomy chapter 30 verse 4. If any of thine be driven out unto the outmost parts of heaven, from thence will the Lord gather thee, and from thence will he fetch thee. Amen. Let's go ahead and personalize that. If any of us are driven out from the outmost parts of heaven, from thence will the Lord gather us, and from thence will he fetch us. If I am driven out from the outmost parts of heaven, from thence will the Lord gather me, and from thence will he fetch me. Amen. May the mercy of God always locate us and our families in Jesus' name. Amen. Your mind 
and sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. battles in Jesus name. Amen. We praise you Father for giving us victories in the name of Jesus. We praise you Father for giving us victories in the name of Jesus. Father, we praise you. Father, we praise you. We praise you for giving us victories in the name of Jesus. Father, you gave David victory over Goliath. You gave Samson final victory over the Philistines. We know that you will give us victories in Jesus' name. We praise you, Father. We praise you for giving us victories in the name of Jesus. Father, we praise you. We worship you. We adore you. We thank you for giving us victories over every situation in our lives in Jesus' name. We praise you, Father, for giving us victories in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father, for showing us great kindness and favor in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father, for showing us great kindness and favor in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We thank you for showing us great kindness, great favor, great mercy, great love in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you for you are a kind and loving Father. We thank you, Father, for giving us great kindness, for showing us great kindness and favor in the name of Jesus. Father God, we thank you because we know that you are a benevolent God. You are a good God. You are a great God. You're a loving God. You're a caring God. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you for showing us great kindness and favor in the name of Jesus. Amen. 
I paralyze every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. I paralyze every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. I paralyze, I paralyze by fire, I paralyze by the blood of Jesus every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. I paralyze, I paralyze, I paralyze by fire, by thunder, by lightning. I paralyze by the word of God every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. I hold the sword of God in my hand and I dip it in the blood of Jesus and I paralyze every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. I paralyze by the blood of Jesus. I paralyze by the fire of God every unrepentant opposition in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I refuse to cooperate with the enemy of my progress in the name of Jesus. I refuse to cooperate with the enemy of my progress in the name of Jesus. My family members and I refuse to cooperate with the enemy of our progress in the name of Jesus. My family members and I refuse, refuse, we refuse to cooperate with the enemy of our progress in the name of Jesus. We refuse, we refuse, we refuse to cooperate with the enemy of our progress in the name of Jesus, my family members and I will not cooperate with the enemy of our progress. In the name of Jesus, my family members and I will not cooperate with the enemies of our forward movement. In the name of Jesus, my family members and I refuse. We refuse. We refuse. We will not cooperate with the enemy of our progress. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Oh Lord, let the handwriting of the enemy... Turn against the enemy in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord, let the handwriting of the enemy turn against the enemy in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord my God, let the handwriting of the enemy turn against the enemy in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord my God, let the handwriting of the enemy, let the plan of the enemy turn against the enemy, turn against the enemy. Turn against the enemy by fire in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord my God, let the handwriting of the enemy, let every plan of the enemy, let every scheme of the enemy turn against the enemy, turn against the enemy, turn against the enemy in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord God, let the handwriting of the enemy, let every plan of the enemy turn against the enemy by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, let every evil king installed against me be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Lord, let every evil king installed against me be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord God, let every evil king installed against me, installed against my family members, be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord God, let every evil king, let every evil authority installed against my family members and I be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be unseated by fire in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, let every evil king, let every evil authority installed against my family members and I be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed by fire, be paralyzed by thunder, be paralyzed by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Amen. I paralyze all satanic strugglers in the name of Jesus. I paralyze all satanic strugglers in the name of Jesus. My family members and I paralyze all satanic strugglers in in the name of Jesus, my family members and I paralyze all satanic strugglers. We paralyze every satanic effort against our destinies. In the name of Jesus, my family members and I paralyze, paralyze. We paralyze by fire. We paralyze by the blood of Jesus. All satanic strugglers against our destinies in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord God, we paralyze, we paralyze, we paralyze by the word of God. Every satanic struggler in the name of Jesus. My family members and I paralyze, we paralyze all satanic strugglers in the name of Jesus. Amen. 
Oh, Lord God, let all strongholds of debt be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, let strongholds of debt, let all strongholds of debt be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, let all strongholds of debt be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces by the rock of ages in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the book of Proverbs, chapter 22, verse 7, it reads, The rich ruleth over the poor, and the borrower is a servant to the lender. We will not be servants or slaves to lenders in Jesus' name. Therefore, O Lord God, let all strongholds of debt be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces by fire in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces by fire, all strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces by thunder. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces by lightning in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of oppression be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces by the rock of ages in the name of Jesus. Amen. All strongholds of infirmity be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of infirmity be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of infirmity be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of infirmity be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of sickness be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of diseases be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of infirmity, sickness, diseases, be dashed to pieces by fire, be dashed to pieces by thunder, be dashed to pieces by the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of infirmity, be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of sickness, be dashed to pieces, all strongholds of diseases, be dashed to pieces, in the name of Jesus. Amen. All strongholds of curses and covenants, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of curses and covenants be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of curses and covenants be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of curses and covenants be dashed to pieces by fire, be dashed to pieces by fire, be dashed to pieces by fire. In the name of Jesus, all strongholds of curses and covenants be dashed to pieces by the rock of ages, be dashed to pieces by fire, be dashed to pieces by thunder. In the name of Jesus, all strongholds of curses and covenants be dashed to pieces by the blood of Jesus, be dashed to pieces by the blood of Jesus, be dashed to pieces by the power in the blood of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Amen. All strongholds of unprofitable efforts be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of unprofitable efforts be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of unprofitable efforts be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces by fire in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of unprofitable efforts of unprofitable labor of working like an elephant and eating like an ant, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of working hard and having nothing to show for it, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces, be dashed to pieces in the name of Jesus. All strongholds of unprofitable efforts, be dashed to pieces by the rock of ages in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every distance 
stolen from my life by the enemy. I repossess you in the name of Jesus. Every distance stolen from my life and the lives of my family members by the enemy. We repossess you in the name of Jesus. Every distance stolen from my life and the lives of my family members by the enemy. We repossess you. We repossess you. We repossess you by fire, by force. In the name of Jesus, every distance stolen from our lives by the enemy, we repossess you, we repossess you, we repossess you by the power in the blood of Jesus. Every distance stolen from my life, every distance stolen from the lives of my family members by the enemy, we repossess you, we repossess you, we repossess you in the name of Jesus. We recover all the lost ground in the name of Jesus. Every distance stolen from our lives by the enemy, we repossess you by the power in the name of Jesus. Amen. Power of delayed blessings die in the name of Jesus, power of delayed blessings, die, 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 die in the name of Jesus, die, power of delayed blessings, die by fire, die by thunder, die, die, die in the name of Jesus, die, power of delayed blessings, die, 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 die in the name of Jesus, die, amen. In the book of Proverbs, Chapter 13, verse 12, it is written, Hope deferred maketh the heart sick, but when the desire cometh, it's a tree of life. Hope deferred, which maketh one sick, is not our portion in Jesus' name. Power of delayed blessings, die, die, die in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Let us now read our confessions out loud. God's complete love for me casts out the fear of judgment in the name of Jesus. I am set apart from the world unto the living God. Therefore, I am actually a saint. I am not condemned as I live in Christ in the name of Jesus. I actually have the divine nature of God dwelling within me. In the spirit, I am seated with Christ Jesus in heaven, far above all the powers of the enemy. I have eternal life in Christ in the name of Jesus. From the very moment I received Christ until the end, I shall not perish. I am in the hands of Jesus and in the hands of God the Father. Nothing is able to take me out of God's hands in the name of Jesus. No weapon that the enemy has formed against me shall prosper in the name of Jesus. As I humble myself and fear the Lord, I find riches, honor, and life. As I meekly engraft God's words into my life, it saves my mind from thinking wrong thoughts, my will from making wrong decisions, and my heart from feeling wrong emotions in the name of Jesus. Jesus is always with me. I will not have to face the wrath of God because I have received salvation through our Lord Jesus Christ. God has called me unto himself, but not according to my words, but by his own gift of grace in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. 
Let us pray for our general overseer, Dr. D. K. Lukoya. Let's pray for his dear wife and let's pray for their children. We thank God for their lives. We soak them in the blood of Jesus and we surround them with the fire of the Holy Ghost. We decree it is well with them in Jesus' name. They will not faint, nor will they grow weary in their divine assignment. In the name of Jesus, O Lord my God, let your hand of grace, let your hand of mercy and favor upon them never cease in the name of Jesus. Every satanic struggler against our general overseer, his family, his calling, and his ministry, let that satanic struggler be paralyzed, be paralyzed, be paralyzed by the blood of Jesus in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord my God, you said that you'll build your church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. We seal our prayers. We seal the answers to our prayers and our testimonies in the blood of Jesus. We decree no evil carryover into 2023 in Jesus' name. As we enter 2023, we are surrounded by favor, by the fire of God, and by the blood of Jesus. Holy Spirit, overshadow us. Holy Spirit, overshadow us. Holy Spirit, overshadow us in Jesus' name. God of Elijah, turn us into fire. God of Elijah, turn us into fire. God of Elijah, turn us into fire in the name of Jesus. 2023, favor us by fire in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let us say the grace in fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Three, thank you, Jesus, hallelujahs, as we prayerfully enter into 2023. Hallelujah, 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 amen. Thank you for praying with us today. Have a blessed day in Jesus' name, and do join us tomorrow for day five. God bless us. Thank you, Jesus, amen. I have joy, 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 joy.